What's going on guys? Welcome back to another Dominaria draft on magicthegathering.uk.ru.org hmm. Esquire. I don't know what the pick here is. The Mending of Dominaria maybe? I mean, this gets back a bunch of cards. Yeah, but it's kind of like dirtily. Yeah, but this is a dirtily format. Shivan Fire is good. Gideon's Approach is good. Settle the Score is good. It's double black. This is double green. You get two creatures back, and you get to return all the lands that hit the hit the bin. Yeah, but you can whiff. <laughs> you what are you? How are you gonna whiff? You play it when you have two creatures in your graveyard. That's not how that works. What do you mean? Put the top two cards of your library. Then you may return graveyard. a creature card from your graveyard to your hand. Right. Yeah. You just wait till you have creatures already in the graveyard. Oh, uh, okay. I'm taking that. I want to build around this. I want to take Blessed Light. Okay. Or Garna. We can just play all the creatures. Put all the creatures in the graveyard deck. It's Exile. I don't even know what you're saying, Gid Gidvi. Yeah, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try mending. So the thing is, like, settle is just an uncommon that kills a dude. It's a great. It's a great rule spell. It's super. It's super efficient. Um, but what I want to do is play cool rares that I don't often get the chance to play with. So let's see how that works out for us. And to do so, I think we're gonna take Blessed Light or Garn. Like Garn is just the better card, I think. Well, it puts us into three colors. Yeah. Oh, but also you can put two creature cards in your two cards in your graveyard, get one back, and then get the rest back with Garna. True. I don't know. I'm gonna take Gar I'm gonna take Garna. So the thing is, settle is better because it exiles, sure, but it's also four mana. It's also a sorcery, and it's also double black. So there are quite a few reasons why it is not, uh, you know, strictly better than, um, than an exile. We Garna, we we got the Garna. We're doing it. I always see Chainer's Torment, and I always get excited thinking it's Bells and Locks Revenge. No, the uh, the Eldest Reborn. That's what I meant. I don't even know what Bells and Locks Revenge is. I have no idea what it's I probably just. Probably not even a card. I, I'm gonna look it up. There's gotta be a bells and locks. A bells and locks something, right? Not right of bells and lock. That's probably what I was thinking of. The other the bells and lock based. This is not good, right? I think it's pretty okay. I'm gonna take this Gideon's reproach. Four colors is where you wanna be, I think. Oh, there we go. Now we're talking. Now we're cooking with gas. Gasoline. Nothing exciting in this pack, but Gift of Growth is fine. Keldon Overseer is fine. <coughs> what are you thinking? What are you feeling here? Anything? I like Memorial. We're going to be putting creatures in the graveyard. What about that Hermit Boy? Hermit Boy? Mm -hmm. the, this? Mm -hmm. Why would I take this blue friggin' mill crab? Because it goes well with your enchantment. I don't want to put my cards in the top in my graveyard. Why not? You get them back. Then I'll just play this to get them back, man. I hate you. I try to love you, but you make it really hard. I think it's I think it's gift. Is there gift or memorial? What do you think, man? Gift. All right. Ooh, dampening sphere. <laughs> Nailed it. It's just like particle wanderer. It's not exciting. It's got to be fungal infection, right? Are fungal infections exciting? Yes, I do. Dark creature gets nega one, nega one. Yeah, and you make a one one. It's not bad. Mm. It's probably better than Partic Wander. I feel like we're closer to Jund than we are to uh, to Naya. Yeah, I'll take that. These packs have not been very exciting. I don't. I actually, this in the three color deck is totally fine. I'll. I'll pay an extra... I'll pay three mana for a Gideon's Approach if it helps us out. 
Rotomuck's okay. I don't think it's one of the better combat tricks in this format. Fire Elemental's also fine. We have the double red right now. Or the double double five drops already, so. God, I'm not a big fan of this card, but I'll take the Invoke, actually. I feel like we should try to stick to three colors. Yeah, but I feel like that's also not very greedy. It's oh, pretty greedy. You want Cyclops instead? Yeah, I think he's fine. Oh, God, he's so bad. I like a Radiant Lightning. Windraise Acolyte actually might want to mill here. This you might said be the... you didn't want to mill. Yeah, but then we, we already have Mending of Dominary and Garna. Maybe this is the one deck we want. Maybe this is the one great one. I try deck... to tell him. And then he has this great idea of milling himself. God, he came Where'd up with he himself, come up with too. It? He's so smart. God, he's so smart. Is it Primordial Worm or Short Sword? I like Worm here. Yeah, I think Worm's a little better. I want to have Creatures. Two drops, fine. I've actually gained a lot of respect for this guy because, oh, I like Gaia's Blessing because if we mill something good, we can shuffle it back in. That is what that card is designed to do. Yeah, that's pretty sweet. I'll take that. What does that two drop do? Uh, if it if it blocks or becomes... It's Corrosive Ooze from Hearthstone. If it blocks or becomes blocked by an equipped creature, destroy the equipment attached to it at the end of combat. Okay. So, get wrecked. Did I? Everybody knows you did. Everybody watched it happen. They watched you got wrecked. Get wrecked? English is not, not going well right now, just to be clear. English uh, is not going well. Michael, it's Grandma. weird okay I'll click this one and this one and I'll delete them oh now it worked okay okay I was just trying to delete some things from my from my eBay list my eBay cool story bro and uh, they was working it was a cool story don't you tell me it wasn't a cool story Had a kicked trunk earlier today. Opponent chumped the trunk ran amok. Huh. I would have believed you meant grun if you if you if it happened once. Happened twice though? I don't know, buddy. Hmm. Might be this guy, actually. We have a lot of legendaries right now and historic cards. Yeah, it's probably Oh, actually Uragos? Ooh. I like an Uragos. Uragos the neighborhood. <laughs> Because it's like, there it goes. We have a good time. I'm taking the Uragos. Who's a ghost? You're a ghost. Who's a ghost? You're a ghost. That's what I just said. It's like you're not even listening to me. You didn't say that. You just answered, you just asked the question. Yeah. And I answered it. Who asked, who, who, who asked the questions around here, who buddy? Who makes the red man red? <laughs> I don't think that's how that goes. Where am I grow from the ashes, man? I want to be growing. <coughs> I think Skizik's actually pretty sweet in this deck too because we can just get him back. We can set, we can just play it as a as a thing and get it back. See again, I'm like, oh, is it Eldest Reborn? No, it's just a Chandra's Torrent. But we do have a Seal Away and a, an Evra Halcyon Witness. Some Seal Away. Make me feel some Seal Away or an Eviscerate. Yeah, let's take that. Yeah, it's probably the correct pick. And it keeps us out of the stupid green. Or the white, rather. I'll put this over here for now. There's no reason to be this ambitious. What's that ghost? Was that because of the spirit? You're a ghost. Hey, bro. You're a ghost. That's like, actually, it's you're gross. You're gross. <sighs> Oh, nailed it. Oh, Sarah Angel. Good lord. What do you think about that, man? Just take the the gorger. But Sarah Angel. You 
can't play four colors, man. We don't have any fixing. Especially with double red. You're run you're not wrong. Whatever, Gorger's good. They're both four fours. Mine just comes down a turn sooner. Hmm. Yeah, it's a four four for four. There's hmm. Okay. You're, hmm. you're thinking about it. There's a couple more abilities on that card that might make a difference. Are there? Mm-hmm. I don't know what they are, though, so it's hard to say. Crossand Druid? It's probably been a Lingering Phantasm, right? I don't think we need another I feel like six. they're about the same. Yeah, but this guy's going to be... Yeah, maybe. I don't know, man. I think it's a three drop. Okay. Especially because this is going to put a bunch of lands into play so that we can just kick it. Like kick the Beastie it. Boys. Kick it. Oh, Ergos number two. Ergos number dos. I'm going to take the, the double Ergos. Ergoros. You're gross. Still got it. <laughs> I made myself laugh. <laughs> I did. I did. I made myself laugh. I don't even care what you think of it. Oh, wow. I'll take a little slot. Yeah, definitely. Now we just want some spore infestations, infest, infestations, as they say in the Italian. In the Italian. That's where they say it. This guy's probably also fine as one of. I like a compass. Compass is pretty good. For as us. you may know. I feel like it might be needed. I really just want to know where my girl from the ashes at. Really? Yeah, we can get more. Wow. It's a late things. These are late things. Well, every 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 time we see a fall of Thran in a draft, there's always a second fall of Thran in that same draft. Hmm. You may return another historic print. So we can actually bounce the mending. That's pretty cool. We can also bounce Garna, which is pretty cool. Yeah, I'll I'll do that. I'm on board. What's better, seven six or five five death touch? Hmm. Probably five five death touch. Yeah, I like having the variety. I just put him in the sideboard. Cause I don't think we need another six drop. <laughs> well, I think you'd play him over. Over the, the other guy. Yeah. Maybe. Just use that one. This one? Okay. Yeah. There you go. Mm, okay. Okay. <clears throat> All right, we're gonna need some. Uh, We're going to need some Ash Boys. Ash Boys in pack three. Ash Boys? Yeah, Girl from the Ashes. Those are Ash Boys. Hmm. You need that ketchup or what? Here. He didn't need it again. <laughs> One day. God, how many times do I have to open this stupid card? A lot, apparently. Apparently a lot. I guess it's just Sapling Migration to go with our Wild Onslaught. Yeah, it seems decent. Could also be Land or Elf or Power Stone Shard. Yeah. You don't like that? Yeah. Okay. Well, I tried. Hmm. And you failed. Is that worth splashing the white? No, I guess we just take Wizard's Lightning. Old yeah. Wizzy Lightning. Yeah, it's all, it's all Lightning Wiz. Now, I like Migration better than Skizik here. We don't want to play another 5 drop for one thing. Ooh, Yogmoth's Vile Offering, though. It's pretty good. Legendary, Legendary, Double Ergoros. I mean, that seems fine. Spore Swarm is also pretty good. I think it's got to be Vile Offering here, though, right? Take the rare. Gotta hate this Cyclops. Yeah, that's a big payoff. I agree. Ooh, did we splash the double blue? No. Okay, well, I wanted to check. Thorn Elemental or Ancient Animus? How much removal we got? Viscerate, Wizard's Lightning, uh, Yogmoth's 
That's pretty much it. Probably take the animus then. Yeah, all right. I don't love it, but I think it is reasonable. I'm just taking the Arvad. Arvad. <laughs> it is Arvad. You're right. I don't. If we get another Power Stone, I might just play that, but I don't foresee that happening. I also don't care about Ace Theory Glider that much. You alright, man? You just you explode? A little bit. Oh, that's too bad. Sorry about your luck, buddy. Oh, Spore Storm. Alright. Well. We're in luck. More cards we have to cut. Oh, Arvad can go to the sideboard. We're not playing that guy yet. Unless we unless something works out really in our favor. Isn't this league? Yeah, uh what is I don't I don't get the question. I don't understand what you're asking me. Well, is it? Well, yeah. Just I just said that. <clears throat> yeah, I don't like this Cyclops at all. I think he's actually just just the worst. Someone was saying to pick Reach because he played past Sarah. Oh, yeah. I mean, we're not going to play. Yeah, right, right, right. Good call, good call. Yeah, we're not going to play against the same people we're drafting with, most likely. It's possible. I don't think it's very likely, though. Man, look at all these. Oh, there we go. Oh, man. There it is. It's got to be Girl from the Ashes, right? Even though there's a yeah. Dark Bargain and a Fire Intervention that I would love to take here, I think Girl from the Ashes is way too valuable for this deck. Thank goodness. There's only 12 creatures, but we do have a Spore Swarm and a Sapling Migration, so it's more. It's closer to 50. 15? 14? Numbers? Numbers and letters? Uh, I th actually thought Omnivore could be good. We have a good amount of Saprolings from Fungal Infection, Spore Swarm, and Migration. So here's a question. What's y'all's favorite candy? Yeah, I like this guy better. Um... Ooh, double power stone shard? No, probably not. It's okay. Probably just taking the final parting just in case. Final parting was sweet one round when we, uh... Eh, Stronghold Confessor's a thing. When we were able to search for our Jaya's immolating inferno. I think my favorite candy are those royal egg things. Royal eggs? Yeah, they're like wrapped in gold. You can buy them at the grocery store. They're kind of expensive. The hell are you talking about? Royal eggs. It's like it's like a ball of chocolate and it's got peanuts and stuff. Um, Ferro Rocher. Yeah. Okay, those are good. Yeah, the Ferro Rocher eggs. Yeah, those are good. I can get behind that. I approve of your choice. I don't buy them often because they're expensive, but sometimes you are gotta they? treat you gotta treat yourself. Treat yourself. I mean, compared to normal candy, yeah. Is this too greedy? No. With four legendary creatures. Seems fine. We also have ways to get legendary creatures back, like Mending. So, like, as long as we have one, we should have multiples. Alright, so I'm going to put Grow. Grow is probably going to stay at three. You're going to be at seven, because that's where you belong. That dude steals a dude, yeah? Yeah. I steals a dude. Might be Guardians of Koilos. Yeah, that's pretty cute. I mean, it's it's we can bounce Garna or the oh, it's not it's doing that thing where it doesn't actually let me zoom in, which is probably wow. All these matches are still up. That's amazing. Which is probably frustrating enough for me to restart. Um, you're gonna be on eight because that's where you're probably best. You're on oh, this is seven right there. All right. Candy bar, MF not first class <laughs> candy. Oh, geez, someone got triggered. 
if bananas get that garbage count- candy out of here. If bananas counted, Mike would definitely. Oh, bananas, hundred percent. Bananas probably is the favorite okay, flavor. Okay, if ever. I had to pick, pick a low class, a low a, a, a shit trash tier candy. tier candy bar, I would probably go with Reese's. What I don't. You? Reese's is not trash tier, bro. I would probably go with Butterfinger. Yeah, but you get it all in your teeth. Bro, you get you get blizzards with That's extra different. butter. How is that because different? Because it's broken up, so they don't really get stuck in your teeth. Please. No, seriously, it doesn't. No, for real. It's a different experience, dude. <laughs> Guess you like that one. Corrosive, gift, sappy, sappy boy. It's not the same when you... I also often wonder what Butterfinger is. Is it like actual butter that they make that stuff out of? Butter. What is it, you know? What is it, you know? It's like peanut butter. Mike's high thoughts. But but not really peanut butter. Like, what is Butterfinger really, dude? Like, what are you eating when you eat Butterfinger? Like, if you tried to make a Butterfinger from scratch, you'd have no idea what to do. I'd know. No, you wouldn't. I made one yesterday. All right, this actually looks better now because we get to add one card. So it's either Kelvin Overseer at seven. Reese's is trash tier can M M peanut butter? No way, dude. Incorrect. We've had that debate and and <laughs> David, you, know. you saw that. I'm sure you saw the poll too, bro. You know it got crushed. Crushed. Straight crushed. Mike is not a stoner. He just plays one you on my it. stream. What? I don't know it. You don't know what I do at four AM. Um I mean, I packed that bowl, boy. Is so this guy gonna sleep? I think we. I think this is fine as is. It's one of these two. I think overseer can probably just win games. But I really do like the idea of bouncing our mending, but mending, but. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I said a butt joke. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. I did. I did say a butt joke. Just shut the hell up about it. Um, this actually seems fine. We don't have very much. We have four red cards, so I think we can get by with eight, six, three, and a grow. All right, let's do it. I'm excited. This deck looks sweet. Yeah, pretzel M and M's are pretty all right, but they're they're a completely different beast from like Reese's Pieces. Reese's Pieces are probably my favorite. I'm going to go get some Reese's Pieces after this draft, boy. What, are you going to go to the store? Well, that's where you get them, right? Yes. So probably, yeah. The Sev? No, I'm probably just going to make food. I, I should have eaten dinner before this draft. Before oh, this stream, wow. rather than after. You haven't eaten dinner yet, huh? No, I'm dinner free. <laughs> Oof. That's rough. It's not ideal. You going to eat at 1 a.m.? It's going to be a 1 a.m. breakfast, yeah. Breakfast? Yeah, I'm going to be cooking some eggs and some hash browns oh, and okay. some little sassy discs. Little sassies? Yeah, some little sassies. I got some steak. I'm probably going to eat in a bit. You haven't eaten, have you eaten dinner? Yeah. So you're just going to have second dinner? Well, it's not a lot of steak. Oh, okay. Just a little dinner snack. It's like, you know, one steak. Hmm. <laughs> well, isn't that it's something? It's like three-fourths of a steak. Well, you know, you can't just have one, right? Right. I don't think we just play this. I, I don't. I don't think that's good. It was one of my two dinner steaks. Hey, man, don't you start your job on Monday? Yeah. How are you feeling about it? Fine. Okay. You scared? Why would I be scared? You want me to drive you to work? No, I think I got it. You want to pack your lunch? That would be nice. What kind of lunch you want me to pack? A little, uh... I don't know. PB&J, probably. A little PB&J? Yeah. Okay. We can do a little, uh... A little peanut butter and jiggly. No, definitely not peanut butter and jiggly. I don't know what that is, and you need to stop. I'm going to eviscerate this creature, and then we're going to play our Wind Grace Acolyte next turn. And mill three of the best cards in our deck. <clears throat> yeah, that's fine. Here we go. Mending Garnerata right off the top. Ready? 
Fungal Overseer Corrosive Ooze. Actually, that's fine. I don't care about any of those things. But they're your deck. Right. That's correct. God, I keep forgetting this guy's a 3-2. So miserable. I just paid five mana for this thing. And they just <laughs> shiv and fired it for one. Crying yeah, out that loud. is pretty rough. Look at this Cabal Stronghold. Well, that's a thing, isn't it? Isn't it? Isn't it? Oh, well, I do want to get rid of that. Ugh, just dial an omnivore and like. I guess we can just discard this. What's the origin of the thick boy clip? Um, thank you for the thank you for the the bits. By the way, really appreciate it. Uh, the origin is just that. Anthony Fantano, who is a YouTube personality who does record reviews, uh, that was part of a clip he, he made, and uh, it's just funny. It sounds funny. Discard's random? Yeah, man. God, magic's hard, dude. Well, so long, Wild Onslaught. Not because not it's the best. It's just what's going to get hit. Oh, the Gift of Growth. Hey, that's what we wanted to get discarded anyway, buddy. Yeah. Good work. You did good work there. I would appreciate it if you didn't attack me like that. I don't care what you appreciate. Future. It's not very nice. You're not very nice. I try. What do you try? To be nice. Do you? Yeah, I think so. Do you? I don't agree with you. That's your decision. You know what else is my decision? No. Exactly. Well done. I want them to try to kill this guy so I can actually... Oh, it's going to happen. Oh, God, here we go. Oh, this is just... Gr Wait, can't I just sack a dude to pump him? They have two cards in hand. I think we benefit from having more of these. I, I just want to get this dude off the board. Wow, well, Michael, I'm checking my telephone. Freshly roasted peanuts are chopped and made into a creamy peanut butter that is blended with a sugar candy. This unique substance is kneaded, rolled, cut, and covered in chocolatey coating. Wow, that's crazy. Man, Butterfingers be crazy. Can I draw a forest so I can play Gorger, followed by any other land so we can kick Onslaught and then just go ham? Go John Ham here. And that's not it, but I'll take it. Hmm. Yes. You want looking at Garfield cartoon? Yeah, man. Okay, that's pretty good. Did you take a peek? <laughs> <laughs> All right, that's pretty funny. It's Garfield getting destroyed. Well, I can't even. It's spoilers. I can't give it away. Yeah, don't do it. I can't even give. I can't even tell you guys the story. I mean, Fantano is entertaining sometimes. Does, does Fantano even have a sidekick? Oh, I see. Now, who is the one with the Ergaros? I think I think this is an alpha moment, and we can wild onslaught. That seems I feel safe. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Like they take tonight's 12. events have been brought to you by Alpha Movement. Alpha Movement moment. Alpha I meant, moment. I meant moment. Oh, I meant moment. <laughs> Did you not hear me say moment? Alpha moment is the high class citrus fruit blended drink. Is it? That you'll love. Will you? That it's called Alpha Moment, the drink, the blended citrus yeah. fruit drink. Mm -hmm. Why? That's a terrible. That's a terrible name for a blended citrus How fruit. How dare drink. you? We're a multinational company. Multinational. Mm -hmm. How many nations? All of them. Every nation. Every one, bro. I'm gonna be honest, man. That's impressive. Yeah. Maybe next time you hold your tongue. Why, am I, why, why, don't, why would I hold it? Someone's got to. It has all the vitamins in the alphabet? Good lord, Chris. That's unbelievable. I'm learning so much today. This stream brought to you by educational Michael Bartholomew's Educational Moments. Oh, you're going to pay a cost here. Oh, you're going to cast my guy down into the, into the abyss. That's unfortunate, but that's okay. 
Gonzalo's an alter ego sidekick whose name is Cal Kukesta. Cal recently released an EP putting even more pressure on the highly anticipated ice chewing EP. Wow. Who knew? So our opponent's deck is actually cast down Shivan Fire, Shivan Fire, Ergaros. They're, all their cards have been good so far. Oh my god. What if we Yawgmoss? Well, no, we can't because it's legendary. I mean, we can Yawgmoss Vile Offering and kill their guy and steal something else. Like a uh, Feral Abomination seems fine. <clears throat> also has plenty of vitamin R, just like Mulk. What's that Mulk? album, at least, was mixed by Lil Boofy. God, can you stop killing my things, man? Is that your second Eviscerate? No, we had an Eviscerate, I guess. I get, I get my Eviscerates confused. They all blur together, you know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? Wow, this is an aggressive attack here. But I guess they're not going to block with it, so it all makes sense. It's all coming up. Oh, and they play a little Bloodstone Goblin. That's not the color we're looking for here. Correct. I like that my Sapperlings are literally just eating their creatures. Eat your tutu. Eat your this guy. Eat your this guy. Oh. No, we just take two this time. Now you might block with this like guy? Like A1 or 57? Do you mean like, do I prefer... Ketchup or... No, Heinz 57 sauce. Or A1. Okay, well, that's pretty good. And probably going to win you the game because we haven't drawn a second green in 12 turns. <laughs> and you were able to kill every one of my legendary creatures, which is only one, to be fair. I'm a Worcestershire man. So they're just going to go land, shoot both my guys, attack for 6, 7, 8, 9... I really don't like that I have to choose and then kill. I wish I could kill and then choose because then I can get to target this guy. But you're targeting, you're choosing targets at the same time, not after one part resolves. So that never, that's never going to work anyway. But I did not combo my eviscerate. Unfortunately, really, you're not just going to shoot my guys. You're going to shoot one of them, right? You got it. Fashion late to the party. Well, seven seven. Yeah, that is correct. That's weird, man. Why are you weird? The true snake fanatics, like which sure. True snake fanatics? Snake fanatics, yeah. A1 has raisins in it, and I don't like it. A1 also ha or Worcestershire has anchovies in it, so I'm... I'm fine with that. Weird. Would you eat anchovies on your pizza? No, I've had that. It's terrible. Why not? I just explained why. Did you? There's a difference between an anchovy and a little bit of anchovy in something. Is there? Yes, very much so. Tell me about it. Tell me about your anchovy. <laughs> uh, she was a lovely woman. Was she? I ate my steak blue. I don't know what that means. So you're going to hit this guy. Okay. Do you have something that deals five for three? Fight with fire is a sorcery. Vicious offering. Sure. That's amazing. That was an amazing turn. Sure. That'll do it. Oh, wow. Your deck is insane. No pierce the sky, huh? Okay, well, that's unfortunate. Yeah, nothing really I want to like. Huh, blue means raw. Interesting. I don't understand what that means. Mike's anchovy was actually responsible for cracking the encryptions used by Nazi Germany in World War II. Wow, man. That's impressive. You yeah. Should, you should share that. Well, 
I'm a modest person. Dude, that's a big deal. Excuse me while my business murder. <laughs> oh, good old anchovy. Here, give me a swamp on top. How about that? That's not a swamp. It's okay, you draw it next turn. I bet. Actually, I don't know what we can draw here. This is not an ideal hand, unfortunately. Yikes. <clears throat> wow. Always a two for two. We have Bailoth Gorger here. It's a wizard's lightning, Hattie. I don't think we're winning this round, unfortunately. I think our opponent's deck is insane. And, like, the more time that goes by, the better positioned I feel they're in. They also missed a land drop, though. See if they can miss two. Oh, you're just gonna shiv and fire my guy. They they did miss two. It looks like unless they just unless they're one of those dudes that plays uh the post combat land. They are not. Oh, that's that's beautiful. Did I just wait a turn for that? Like, there's nothing I want to play next turn. Yeah, I can just wait. That's, I mean, I'm assuming I'm drawing a land next turn, and then I'm just going to grow for the ashes for two swamps. God, just don't have run amok. I'll feel so stupid. All right. <clears throat> They're missing mana, so like, one of the way, one of the few ways we die in this game is if we don't deal with their things. Nailed it. Hey, that's pretty good. Swamp, swamp. I can cast everything. Everything's coming up Millhouse. I'm a true faggot at heart and I'll suck at A1 out of a bottle. I'm disappointed in you, Mike. Wow, that's a, uh, that's aggressive. All right. I uh, have eight lands in play now. That's good. Our opponent has not hit a fourth land, but they will now. Boop. There it is. So now they get to play something uh, pretty good, like, I don't know, like a Whisper or something. They can sag these guys, get back Death Bloom Talon. Mm, that guy's good. It's probably better. We could fungal infection this guy and then pump the one one to. Man, what a combo! Yeah, it's a good use of our. I guess we're going to nine here because we're just not drawing anything that isn't land or mediocre cards. We're all, why why got all these mediocre cards in our deck? In before eviscerate. <sighs> <coughs> And there we go.
we go. All right. Always a pleasure, opponent. Always a pleasure. I guess when you get stuck on land, when you draw a Viscerate, Shiv and Fire, Cast Down, it's pretty good. All right, a 2-2. Two -two. It's okay. We got this. We're still in it. Mm-hmm. Shiv and file. Hmm. <laughs> oh, good times, good times. No, it's okay. You have Vicious Suffering and Shiv and Fire. Totally understandable. Well, what did you expect? I guess not that. Now I will finally kill this idiot. Jesus. Vicious, vicious offering, Shiv and Fire, Eviscerate, Shiv and Fire, Cast Down. <laughs> oh, Got him. Not yet we don't. I mean, they still have four cards in their hand. It's unbelievable. What's even happening right now? Now they're just going to play Ergaros. We just go to five here. Like, how greedy do we get with this? I guess just greedy enough. Oh, fun game. Fun game. We're going to die to 1-2. Hopefully you just threw it all away. Hopefully you just have no more removal left. I would hope so by now. Good lord. This is actual ridiculous. Okay, you don't have an attack. Oh, well, that's not great. But if you play it post-combat, it's like it has Vigilance. Yeah, it's like it has Vigilance, actually. A fair point. Random card. Oh, pay costs. Garna. Sure. That doesn't do anything, but... Why didn't you play that last turn and attack with it? Oh, it's other creatures you control. Sure, Gitu Chronicler. Why didn't you play Chronicler last turn? I don't understand anything that's going on right now. Ugh, I'm at five. Do I just play the second Ergos? I think you might have to. Crying out loud, dude. Give me Yogmoss. Yogmoth's Vile Offering one time. I'm oh, just going to play Karamazov. There you go. Vile Offering one time. Oh, it has Haste. So we basically have to block here. Now I don't want Vile Offering anymore because I don't have a Legendary guy. I think we did. Amazing. Actual amazing. Okay. <laughs> Okay, cool. We're having a good time. <coughs> oh, magic. You are a real fun game. Good times, good times. I will play first. Yeah, one any anyone green in the sand is great. We got eight eight forests in the deck. Seven forests, something like that. Oh, they mold five. All right. Mm. 
man, didn't see Rada in any of those matches. Didn't see uh, the mending in any of those matches. I was going to say, it's a little early for the conceit, isn't it? I'm out, man. Peace. Well, they didn't play any creatures because they were stuck on three for infinite turns. Oh, here we go. This guy's going to kill us. All right. Oh, no green yet. Here we go. Here comes. Here comes limited boggles. Arcane flight. Wow. It's one of those drafts, boys. One of those drafts. Actually, don't know what we do about that. Uh, it's pretty sure you get wrecked. Oh boy. Go to four here. Hope we eviscerate. No. Okay. That was a fun game. Had a good time. Having a good time. Both of these both of these matches so far have been joys. Still no Pierce of the Heart Pierce the Pierce of the Wild? Pierce wings? Pierce little, this guy. Little wings? Okay. Little wings. <laughs> okay. Well let's try again. Old, try, try, old try Dominaria again. Boggles got us that time. Sure did. Sure did. Sure. Sure. And they mulled a five that game. Can we remember that they mulled a five? Oh, yeah, they did. Holy That's crap. amazing. Just incredible. You can go there on the off chance we draw two lands, let alone the right colors. That was a good mic bop you did there. Yeah, I thought it was all right. Oh, wow. All right. Well, we had a good run, guys. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Ah. <sighs> Oh, is it that giant thing that doesn't untap? Yeah, it's a 7-7. Seven, seven. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, magic. Here, hold on. 2-3. I, I got this. We got this. Nailed it. It's okay. He probably won't be able to untap it, right? No, of course not. I'm sure he doesn't go land uh, Voltaic guy that untaps things, equip it, attack for 12. I'm, that's never going to happen. And our opponent's 0-1. That's impressive. Hmm. Oh, I see. Well, as long as it stays tap, I think we're fine. Yeah. Yeah, man. <laughs> totally. Totally fine. Mother of God. Here we go. Six mana Partic Wanderer. Sure. I'm just going to take 15 because... Oh, it has Trample, so it doesn't even... We're literally in top deck mode right now. This has been an amazing experience. Oh. That'll do it. <laughs> I'm just like, I can't. I just can't. I 
Oh, she's legendary. They can just move the sword over. I don't even care anymore, dude. Yeah. Yeah, we're dead. Yeah, that I I'm yeah, that was I'm just done. I'm just Who boy. Play it out, I guess. I think this has gone well. I think our first two rounds were incredibly fair. Uh they were uh very uh oh boy, I don't even have the words. The wherewithal. I just want some I just want some food. No, at least these games haven't lasted too long for you. Yeah, that's true. What is this? Uh, we're about less than an hour in so far. That's cool. So, uh, you know, good times. Good times. You didn't let Mike pick. This is why we lose. Maybe. Maybe. No, this is definitely making YouTube. This is definitely making YouTube. This is a this is a highlight reel. Uh, so if can, I've ever you seen can one. You feel the misery with us. Yeah, like I'm. I don't. I don't just cherry pick my videos and only post the ones where I have winning records. Also, I mean, like you can't get blown out this badly in a whole draft and 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 hide from it. You just got to embrace those losses. <clears throat> oh, I like this corrosive ooze with this short sword. <clears throat> That's a combo. I mean, like, with you know, if, if both players had one half of the combo. You know, like that. And one player really doesn't like it. Right. Exactly like that. It's a mountain? Oh, that's great. That's exactly what I wanted. Thank you. Oh, no, it's not a mountain. Okay. Just checking. Just thought of something else. Oh, that's old Gor Gorgy. Gorgy Georgie. So I can watch this again on my on the way on the way home Monday. Yeah, sure. If that's what does it for me. For you. What I say for me? I don't even know. It's late, man. What do you want from me? Man, it ain't even midnight yet. You're right, it ain't that late. I lied. In fact, it's two minutes to midnight. Two minutes to mid is that how the song goes? Yeah. Nice. It actually literally is two minutes to midnight. Oh, look at this, dude. Corrosive ooze all day. I'll be oozing all day. It sounds terrible. Midnight. Midnight. It's all night. Our opponent hasn't done anything yet, so I don't know what to, I don't know what's going on right now. There's a lot of confusion in my heart. Oh, last two minutes. Two minutes to milk Mike. Wow. Can I not milk him after midnight? Is he a gremlin? Yeah, that's true. Wow, I didn't know that, man. That's weird. I'm so sorry about your lactation issues. Let's <laughs> stop talking about this. <laughs> I don't want to. I think you do. I don't. Oh, a 4-5, eh? Make me feel some four or five wit. I guess I could just kill it. I'm gonna do that. <clears throat> and then I'm gonna get in there with my boys. This conversation is awkward. I don't know what's happening right now. Everybody's a little uncomfortable. Oh, 
Oh, what did he say? He said, mm, okay. And then I said, but excuse me. Funny joke. I'm not going to sideboard. The funny thing is the deck, I don't think the deck looks that bad. Like our top end is good. We have a lot of versatile cards like Cross and Druid and Sapling Migration that are good at different points on the curb. Kel and Overseer. We have good removal. Wizards, uh, Lightning, Eviscerate. I guess we don't have a ton of removal. I guess that would be the flaw. But then we have like Wild Onslaught. We have Fungal Infections, which are tricks. We have a Gift. I don't think Gift is great. But then we have like Mending Dominance, Garna, Rada, Yogmas Vile Offering. Urgos is supposed to be pretty good. I don't feel like our deck is that bad, actually. I think, if anything, it wants a Navigator's Compass. But, short of that, like, I, I don't think this deck should have been... Uh, I think we just got literally blown out in uh, in round two by the ridiculous multi five double boggles, uh, play my 7-7 seven, seven legendary, equip my 7-7 my, my seven, seven rare legendary, equip my rare legendary sword to it that gives plus five plus five and uh in round one they just had everything so i don't know i don't want to make excuses we did pass i just don't want to shortchange the deck either because i don't necessarily think this is like we yes we passed we probably passed multiple compasses compass i if you will compassi as the italians say i don't think that's true please you don't know my life made that up you don't know my life Look, that's the first time we've drawn the Mending of Dominaria. And it won't be the last. No, it will be, because there's... Or will it be? Yes, it will be. This draft is over after this. Or won't it be? Mountain, please. Okay, well. Is this the same artist? Simon Dominic Matthias something. So, no. The answer. Get in there. The answer is nay. The answer, my friends, is different artists. That's all I got. It's very good. You said it wasn't very good? Mm hmm Wow. What kind of friend are you? A bad one? Probably. Mountain. Okay. You know what? Whatever. I'll actually trade here. My guy's going to the graveyard is better for mending. Hmm. Mike, when's the last time we had Whoopi? Amped wants to know. Ask your mom. <laughs> hey, ask your mom the last time Mike made Whoopi. He knows. Does she? I gave a solid wink there. Oh, did you? I, was, I didn't see it. I was looking at the game. I appreciate you giving that strong wink. God, I really want a way to deal with that. <coughs> Can I get an eviscerate off the tippity top? Probably not, but, you know. Oh, we did it, boys! That's amazing. The universe is indeed... A simulation. That Even was... when it goes right for you, it's a simulation? Well, a lot of times it goes right. A lot of times I'm like, can we just draw this? And then we draw it. It's not always bad stuff. Hmm. In my draft today, I had double squee, double chain whirler, triple ship and fire, drives in front of quad four four ogre. I don't like that four four ogre. Wait, no, I'm thinking of the Cyclops. What's the ogre? I'm thinking of rampaging Cyclops. Is there a four four ogre? Or are you thinking of Cyclops? And you said it wrong. Gross case. That guy's the only thing I don't like, but other than that, your deck seems insane. So I have four mana? Alright. Alright, good. These are the only two things I can get in counters? Deal. Yeah, but the problem... I mean, the, the thing about your deck is that... I think that guy is great if you have... Inst exactly, that's what I'm saying. The thing about your deck is that you have enough removal to actually put their blockers out of the way. Put those blockers out the way. Well, we're going to tri a triple attack here. Do we mending? I think we mending. I 
At worst, we get corrosive ooze. At best, we get... I'm going to take this. So we're going to get one forest back on the third. And like next turn during our draw step, we can just take corrosive ooze if we have to. But if we do have to, uh, if something better hits the graveyard, I'd rather have this and something better than... Um, You know, you know what I'm saying. I don't have to explain this to you. No idea. Yeah, Squeeze is actually really good in this format because it just keeps coming back. He. He just keeps coming back. He is a Squee. <laughs> they never don't have it. <laughs> Frank Lepore. Fantastic. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> uh, just, just to be clear, D's Nuts has been called. It set it up and it knocked it down. I appreciate Case for playing along. Alright, let's see what's going in the trash can. Oh, Gorger. See, that's better than the stupid idiot. Still no mountains, though, which is, uh... That's something. Yeah, I'd rather have this guy to kick later. We're gonna take six of the air. Oh. And we get one forest back. That's pretty sad. Oh, interesting. No attack with the old Cloud Rider. Cloud Reader? Actually, we do get. Oh, we do get. We have Wild Onslaught. We do get an eighth land, so that's pretty brutal. What up, Dank Memes? Oh, that's a good card. Oh, your last card's not a land. Good times. That's not a dang it. Where's the mount? Where are my mountains at? Oh, we only have seven mana. Nothing's nothing's coming up. Nothing's working out. Nothing's working out, Millhouse. That's real sad, actually, because three threes are able to trade profitably here. Two twos are not. What a difference! What a difference one mana makes. You just go block, 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 and take four, and everybody dies. It's like not even worth it. Whatever. This guy's fine. Oh. Good to know. Alright, are we dead? Probably. Who knows? Wow. Amp, you were in a you were in a mood tonight, man. It's pretty funny. These ground guys are staying home. These ground boys. What's it gonna be? Oh, old Thorny, huh? Well, probably gain ten here. Yeah, we I still have seven mana. Oh, yeah. Dang. Yeah, eight would have been significantly different because if it was eight and we drew a land, we'd have nine, so we can go Rada Yagmas offering. Like, ugh, ugh. I guess instead we're dead. I feel like Pierce the Pierce the Sky would have been MVP in this entire draft if we had if we had picked one up. Indeed. Um. Yeah, we're literally just dead here. I can't. I just can't even. All right. Um. Yeah, I don't think we're... God, I just want a way to deal with flyers, man. 
Yes, sir. I had FNM. I had one each of one of each colored basic out by turn four. I live the I live the dream. Yeah, that's good times. I can get behind that. Yep, like having that spider. Spider could have been good. I agree with you. Two hundred and thirty two one one two three five eight thirteen twenty one thirty four fifty five eighty nine. What is that? Oh, that's interesting. Can you crack the code? Yes, every number is the last, the previous two numbers added together. Either way, thank you so much, man. Really appreciate it. Oh, is that the Fibonacci sequence? Fibonacci sequence is every, uh, is is every every digit, every preceding, every uh, following digit is the last two. Interesting, interesting. I've seen pi. I feel like I should know that. It's golden spiral. Like you saw a pie once and then you ate it? You don't eat the pie, man. You experience it. I eat them. Whole. Yeah, I I think that's accurate. Two bites. Wow. They, they used to call you old two bite Mike. They still do in some places. Uh, yeah. The... Where, where my warrant for arrests are out. Wow. Wow. Oh, gotta be honest, yeah. I appreciate your honesty. Big of you. Do I have a reason to play this? Yes, because I can play Acolyte next turn. But if we just wait, we can... nah, I'm just going to play it. Waiting seems bad. You seem bad. It's really rude, man. I'm going to get this red this time because Ooh, I have... Ooh, that's risky. I've just... I keep getting stuck on the stupid reds. Getting stuck on the reds. That's the main my... Uh... Prepare to get stuck on black. Well, I already got one black. I could play both two out of three spells in hand. Well, they're not good in pairs anyway. I guess that's true. Alright, what are we milling here? A swamp, a garna, and a wizard's lightning. That's cool. One swamp, which would have helped us cast both of these. And then two cards that we could have played because we got a mountain. I'm sorry, Case. It's hard. Moving on's hard, buddy. Are we going to trade here? That doesn't seem good. I'll just take two damage. Two whole hit points. I have not decided on a 300 sub thing because I don't, I'm actually terrible at doing that stuff. Also raid away, so we'll have to cross that bridge when we come to it. But that's not really incentivizing people to sub, so I don't know. You see what I mean? You see how, see how uh, confounded I am at the, oh, it's six mana, huh? I see. Where's my eviscerate now? What's in the trash can? Like, what's going on with these lands? Yes, I know about those orangutans. We missed two land drops. This is real sad. You're yeah. right. You don't know anything about orang orangutans. <laughs> orangutans. Yeah, I called them that once when I was a kid. Yeah, you still do, though, apparently. Well, I did it because it was funny now. You're funny now. Thank you. Because you're stupid. So this is a 6-6, so it becomes a 12-12? Yep. 
I think we're just going. I think we're just hitting up the O three bracket, guys. This does not feel like a winning. He's uh, gonna get lonely on you. I haven't seen Grun yet. I just saw manageable creatures up until now, so I would have kept the Eviscerate had I known. But I also didn't want them to over uh, overload the board with guys before before this popped. So all right, that's okay. Just kill this guy. Attack me for twelve. Oh boy. Oh, he gets trample this turn. Oh, mother oh, no. sweet How do you trample. Uh, from the oh, yeah. song of frailties. I mean, we'll take. It's okay. We're just taking sixteen. Not a big deal. No big deal. He's only sixteen, twelve, man. No big deal. I'm so sad about my life choices right now. This has not been one of our finer moments. Wow, fashion was late to the party. And I think we're dead. Well, he doesn't keep Trample. Yeah, he's just an Abyss for the rest of the game. Yeah. What's wrong with that? What problem is... I hope I hit two lands next time. I mean, we go take three. I'll block here. He's got First Strike, too. Good for him. Also, Sapperling Migration keeps us in the game, right? Oh my God! Oh, okay, they have no cards. All right, we're good. I think we're good. We've uh, we've we've braved the storm. P presuming we hit land next turn. Actually, getting this guy back is good because we can kick him eventually. So I'll go to three. Three marvelous three Alia Babwa. Give me do, give me two lands all the time. That was actually a good draw. Uh, I'm just gonna get Druid back here. Got us the elite. Got to eat to live. Tell you when I have the time. One mic ahead of the mic, mic. Bark, bark. Chicken, bark, bark. Uh huh. I'm gonna do the thing right now. That's everything. I wish I had one more land here. We could Fungal Infection, kill this guy, Garna to get this guy. We can block, block, and then Garna to get this guy back. Uh, we could play Sapperling Migration for six. We could play one of these guys. We could do a lot more things with a six land. You're right. Yeah. But we ain't got that. Yeah. So we just Fungal Infection and block, block? Ooh. It doesn't seem great, but I mean... Next turn, this is much better. But I guess we could save Garna, too. Alright, whatever. I don't love it. It's the only way. We do get three lands back, which is pretty sweet. Which does put us to eight for the for once. Which means we can uh, kick Cross Android or... You know... Oh, God, that was... Oh, blah, blah. I was supposed to respond to that. Yep. You sure should have. I click the button. Incur I'm kind of tilted right now anyway, so... Actually, now we can kill this guy, so that's pretty cool. <clears throat> that seems better. Alright, they didn't play anything. Alright, we're not dead yet. And this is a very positive thing in my experience. Being not dead? Yeah, not being dead is where I want to really want to be in life. Thirteen life. Amp, do you getting out of here, buddy? If so, have a good night. Oof. 
That guy's that's a big boy. Yeah, we're just gonna chump here. And we are gonna play try to play what do we got? Four, eight, nine mana. So we're hoping for a four drop. Why do you have another thing? Don't play the cloud. Don't play. It's not great. Or a land. Okay. Nope, actually we're still short. Dang it! <sighs> That's annoying. We're so far behind right now. I really wanted to be able to play Garna and get, get this guy back to gain another 10, but... Actually, I think if we pump, we might be okay here. We can go block here, makes us a 5-4, and then chump here. It's not terrible. It's not great, though. I don't understand why we're not dead. It's kind of like we're hopefully like it's it's funny because like we're not dead, but we're also like not alive. Yeah, it's we're really in like draft purgatory right now. I don't know how we can draw to get out of this. Yogmoth's vile offering would, that be, would sweet. be a good start. Oh, oh, just old twelve e twelve. Hmm. Why don't you take it, man? <laughs> I was actually going to be like, oh, all right, cool. So we have another one of these guys in hand. And if we draw land, we can play this guy and then block again and then Garna, which gives us a free hit. And I think being able to Garna and get back this guy is pretty good. So I'm hoping for that land. Or any f one, four, 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 any five mana spell. Oh my god. Stop playing things. I'll take like a spore migration. Didn't we already play that this game? Yes, I thought we did. What does the mending do? Does it shuffle our... Oh, and then yeah. shuffle your graveyard. Oh, okay. Interesting. So we kill this. We go... Wait. Actually, can we go pump? Yeah, we're going to fungal infection... Five and five, so we can go Fungal Infection, Wild Onslaught, Pump Pump. I don't think that's good, though. I guess we just go Block, Chump Block, four, five, six, seven, eight. We get back this guy, we replay him, gain ten. What does, this, any, what does any of this do, though? Slowly kills us. Ah, it's so bad. See, the thing is, if we play Garna, though, and they attack with this guy, we get a free hit off of Garna. Or off of Ergaros. They're also at 14. We're going to pass. We're going to see what happens. I mean, we can go untap, play Ergaros, play Wild Onslaught on our board. Four, five, six, seven... I have no idea what's going on right now. Yeah, that's not suspicious. <laughs> I mean, it doesn't really matter, does it? Like... Yep, that is fine. Oh, our Eviscerate's back in our deck, though, so that's pretty okay. Okay, well, that's actually fine, because now your Land of War Elf is... murderable. Oh, all right. Okay. So 
So I wonder. blocks like this. And we can still play around syncopate if they got it. <laughs> Something good. Is that good? Five, ten, so we have eleven mana, six. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I think we just have to play this guy. Gain an extra twenty. Alright. Like you do. Casual twenty. So this guy just kills us. But we... Yeah, so we're just gonna have to attack with this guy. Hope. <coughs> Interesting. If they have any way to deal with this guy in the two cards, then we're dead, but... I think we gotta take a risk here. That is not it. What's that in there? It's one that lets you dig for cards. Uh, yeah, you look at the top five. You can put a creature into your hand from among them. Oh, 8, 9, 10, 11? Hmm. I think I could just take 11 here. Yeah, it was just better to attack with this guy alone than I have to block. Unless you just wanted to deal 11. Alright, they're playing the last card, which means... Oh, okay, they're moving that. Dang it. That guy's really big. Oh, that's pretty good. That keeps us in business. So they block here. They take 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Oh my god, we're so close. We should have one more mana. Right? Well, actually, it wouldn't do anything. Well, I mean, we would be able to play it this turn. Yeah. My God, the intensity is real. Oh, they're gonna they're gonna do it. <coughs> There's got to be a creature in the in the top five, I imagine. Oh, a whiff! Wow. Oof. Oh, that's great news. Oh, back on, back on old Grunnington, Senior Grunnington. Oh, this is aggressive. So they have one blocker now, but we're adding an extra five power. They block here. They take one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Oh my God! They go to one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We just need a creature that costs three or less. And that's a swamp. If we play this, they block here. Six. And then they take three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Oh my god, in both ways it's Oof. Yeah, the kick doesn't do it. We've already added that. Like they're gonna block the biggest guy. They take one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. It's thirteen. They're at fourteen. One shy shy. Hush hush. I don't want. <laughs> I think we can still I think we can still get through with this guy, though. Like, we, we attack with this guy. We have enough blockers. 
that this guy's real big. Everybody's lethal, though. I got to keep this guy back. They might just think we're trying to throw AI away here. We are not. It's not Xaxes. No, it wasn't. It was shot by one point. I don't guys. know why you guys think it's. Yeah, like you. I don't understand. It's not. It was very close. Fourteen and thirteen are not the same number. But I think we're pricing them out of attacking now. Like if they attack, we block, and then we just have lethal. Like five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. And like we can chump, which is totally fine. Man, if Grun had trample, ooh, this game would be over. And this guy's just gonna do some work from now on, so that's good. Unless they bounce it, but I guess we can still just replay it. Yeah, that guy's big, but so you block the two biggest guys. You take five, six, seven, eight, nine. Again, we're still one power away. That's pretty ridiculous. Oh, that'll that do. That does it though. Wow. And we gain three. Ooh, the one two. Brutal. Brutes o toots. That was great. There's nothing for one mana that bounces a creature, right? No. There's a rescue that can bounce their own guy. Man, this is a surprisingly good game. Like this is back and forth. I thought we were dead when this guy was hitting the board. I serious. He's like, I thought you didn't like the acolyte. I seriously don't like this card. No joke. And we go to five two. We did. We gained an extra twenty three life this game, so that's pretty cool. Cross Android twice, and then uh, Wing Race Acolyte. All right. Woo! Thank you guys so much for watching. Really appreciate it. Not not the re the record we were expecting or uh, or desiring, wanted, but yeah. Still pretty, I mean, like, con considering how the games went, I'm like, it's more like, eh. Uh, so what can you do? Thank you guys so much for watching. Really appreciate it. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. If you guys haven't done so, check out my Patreon. It's patreon.com slash franklapore. You'll get interesting and new content there uh, that is unique from the stream and YouTube videos and stuff. And uh, I'll catch you guys next time. Thanks for watching.